Hello and good evening. Welcome to Stutter Pot TV. I'm your host, NJW, and I'm back with another crime news episode today from Las Vegas, Nevada. They have new laws, y'all. Let's check them out. The new year means new laws. 80 new laws take effect in Nevada today. And Fox News Kim pass out this here with some of the biggest changes all Nevadans are going to see. Yeah, from marijuana limits to tests for breast cancer to voting while in jail. These are some of the laws taking effect today, January 1st, 2024. The amount of marijuana one person can possess just doubled in Nevada. Now 2.5 ounces. Recre 2.5? Now that's a lot of weed you can have on you now. So you can possess 2.5 ounces of weed on you. That's almost a quarter pound. Let's see what we got going on. Recreational retailers are also now authorized to sell medical cannabis to patients without having to obtain a separate license. And new this year, Nevada's Cannabis Compliance Board will have the discretion of issuing a marijuana business license to former felons. The board must determine if issuing such a license would pose a threat to public health and safety. Now that's pretty good. So they they considering giving out um, license to the ex felons. That's that's pretty good. That's a pretty good law there. That's one worth looking into. Tests for breast cancer now must be fully covered by insurance. That includes imaging tests and diagnostic imaging tests. That means no deductible nor copay can be charged. Also in Yeah, but what if you have Medicaid or uh, something that's less than, then what you have to do then? Because a medical, uh, I'm pretty sure Medicaid is not gonna pay for your whole, and your whole test. That's something to look into too. Nevada, Medicaid coverage for postpartum care will change from 60 days to a full year. That includes delivery complications, postpartum depression, and other health care needs, which could ultimately decrease pregnancy-related fatalities. Okay. Solitary confinement is now banned in Nevada prisons, except as a last resort. Even then, the maximum number of days in confinement is 15. Now that's pretty doggone good. You can only be uh, put in a hole for 15 days. I know that's pretty good, but it's gonna be a lot of violence going on because as soon as people get back out, they're getting back in it. New in 2024 with the presidential election in November, jail inmates awaiting trial will now be able to cast a ballot. Oh, so if you in jail and you uh, facing a felony, you still gonna be able to vote. And perhaps one of the most interesting new laws, Nevada is now the seventh state to allow for human composting. That is the process of organically disposing of human remains and converting them into soil. The body is broken down into roughly one cubic yard of soil that can be used on trees or plants. So they're using fetuses as plant-based. That's crazy, but well, that's something new. A list of all the new Nevada laws on our website, fox5vegas.com. Well, that is that is something else. Only on Fox. That, that is something else. They have a new laws that's, and they got so many laws now that it's crazy that I thought the laws was already made for people to, to obey, obey. And now they just making up laws as they go, which, which is good and bad. But if they benefiting, then it's good, but if they're not, then it's bad if they benefit just them, the law makers. So there you have it. Some new laws in Las Vegas. I think my people need to pay attention to all people. So this has been Stutter Pot TV. I'm your host, NJW. Thank you for joining me.